Banks build and simulate complex predictive models every single day. They do it to make money. They do it to manage their risk. And bluntly, they do it because the regulators make them do it. So they have to hire quants to build the models. And then they have to hire software developers to connect the models to the data that they require. And then because the models are so complex, they have to distribute them across clusters of machines. And all of this is incredibly time consuming and very, very expensive. So they're trying to use artificial intelligence to automate it all and really drive down their cost. That sounds great in principle, but in practice, building, connecting, distributing, and injecting artificial intelligence into these predictive models is really, really hard to do. And I know this because I've been building these types of simulations for more than 15 years for organizations like the US Department of Defense, the Bank of England, and a few others. My name is Justin Lyon. I'm the founder of Simudyne. And I thought to myself, there's got to be an easier way to build these types of simulations. So I recruited a world-class team from some of our top universities, and we wanted to fix this problem. And we've done it. We have built a next-generation simulation platform that makes it easy for banks to build these AI-powered simulations. Now, because we're enterprise-ready, Banks can download our software today and start using it immediately to add value to their firms. We are the only simulation platform that is certified to run on Cloudera. That's the market leader in big data software. And that is so important to our banking clients because it tells them that we are secure and scalable. We support artificial intelligence at massive scale. This means that banks can use our software to automate key parts of their business and really drive down their cost. So let me show you and tell you a little bit about an example of some work that we're doing. This is the Bank of England, and they're collaborating with Oxford's Institute for New Economic Thinking. Now, they wanted to build a simulation, an agent-based model of the entire United Kingdom's housing market. But due to computational reasons, they got stuck at only 10,000 households. It's not enough. With our software, they can simulate all 27 million homes, every single home. And that is so incredibly powerful for them because it creates a virtual world where they can safely experiment with all sorts of policies and deeply understand the drivers of booms and busts in the UK housing markets. Our client at the Bank of England says that Simudine would be a true asset for any bank and that we come with his heartfelt recommendation. We're already making money and that's because we have figured out how to sell our software to global banks. Let me give you a concrete example. Over the past 10 or 12 weeks, Barclays has been test driving our software and during that time, they've identified five ways that they can use our software to make money and four ways that they can use it to mitigate their risk. And as a result, they've purchased our software and they're now one of our customers. So clearly, thank you. So clearly, we're going after global banks. But our software can also be used by companies in other industries in oil and gas, in engineering, transportation, and others. And when you add up all the numbers, the total addressable market for our software is $40 billion. It's a massive market for us. But today, we're focusing on selling to global banks. The way that we're doing that is by collaborating with Microsoft, Cloudera, and PwC. They're writing white papers about our technology. They're producing global webinars about what we're doing. But most importantly, they're getting those materials into the hands of their sales force, who've already generated more than 100 qualified leads. So why do banks choose us? For two reasons. 
First, they can install our software onto their infrastructure, which ensures that their data and their models remain proprietary to their firms. Second, they don't have to train folks on how to use our software because we're using technologies that they already know. Over the past two years, we've raised $1.5 million. We've used that money to build and launch our product, and we have successfully done that. Our focus now is on building up a very powerful sales and marketing engine. And that's because we want to get our software into the hands of as many developers as we possibly can. Because at Simudine, we fundamentally believe that all important decisions should be subject to a computer simulation. And we want all of those simulations built with our technology. I hope that you will join us on this incredibly exciting journey as we transform how we make decisions forever. Thank you so much for your attention.